Hello. Wanted to make a quick video and talk about some fun stuff that I've been working on. So, first, let me get some guns and get back to the woods so that nobody can get me here. So, look at that. Oh my god. So much realism now. I know it doesn't look that realistic, or at least my wife said it doesn't. So, um, but who cares? The point is that I made this yesterday and it took me about a couple of hours um, I didn't make it all so I'm not gonna lie to you so this is called Lyra um, Unreal Engine provides a game kind of a framework for developing um, game multiplayer games they provide you this awesome it's not awesome it's freaking awesome so it provides you with all the set of tools that you need to build a, a, a game, a multiplayer game. Um, as you can see, the default stage, and I have already like changed the default stage, and I feel like it's really easy to modify. This is the uh, the initial characters that it brings. I was able to download some characters from the Epic Game Store, and. And be able to change it so this is oh looks like the game is over i should have paused it um so look at this i'm, I'm gonna start killing these people here are my friends i think this is the other batch uh yeah dad. Da, 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 da. so it, it provides you all so look at this it, it has like so much stuff it has game stats even the paying for each cert for the for each connection for each player um, it has an online multi I'm sorry the online networking system from Epic already integrated so I mean it's just so much stuff and basically for free you can use this for any game look at that animation we get some more ammo and so one fun thing I did yesterday was this vegetation I started learning about um, building landscapes and doing procedural vegetations so I started learning how to paint uh, and create layers of materials and then from those material layers um, you can paint them and you can then use foliage um, and auto foliage and, and create this awesome um, environment so and look at that, it even has a freaking wind state. So you can use this this framework, customize it and make your own games if you want. And this is what I'm showing you right now. It's just, it's just like uh, a little bit. So let me go to the main menu so that I can show you further what I mean. So this is the, the Lyra game. You can make it multiplayer online multiplayer local it gives you all the options it also brings like best practices and already has a navigation for um, the game settings but look at this you can go in and, and fetch servers I don't have any servers running right now locally but yeah you can do that and when you play start a game there are so many options so let's do an elimination game here we go look at this just and these are basically default settings oh my god there it is oh. let me get some health Hey team, you're shooting at me. So basically all this comes for free. Like, all you need to do is know how to compile it. I mean, I think it's a fair deal. Look at that, even respawning. So, I'm just gonna play until the, until we win or we lose, whatever. Oh, I think those are my team. Look at that portal. Oh, I got some help. Oh. Let's do this. Hey, look at this animation. I mean, this is 
included. So you can even put it anywhere on any games. And it appeared. Look at this. Oh my god, I'm in love with Thera. And my team won. That's really awesome. So, as you were able to see in this demo, um, I was able to um, change the characters, um, change the amount of players in game session. This is really cool. And all of this is included for free. So, I won't lie, I mean, it's kind of hard to, to get it to work. <laughs> it's not that simple. I've already completed several courses on Unreal Engine. I'm a software engineer and I can deal with the C++ part of it. But if you are, if you are already like got the basics and I mean, you should be like diving into this project because it has so much great stuff. Like it provides you with knowledge enough to build virtual worlds, create game states, and collaborate in, in different areas building a, a game. So I hope you like this. I think the Lero Sample game is really an amazing framework. It provides you with best practices, provides you with assets, it provides you with philosophy of development, a folder structure, a game development environment that if you are get used to it into that you will probably succeed on the on the gaming world and and for me i i say this because i am a software developer and being able to read documentation from others and being able to implement stuff from others i think that's even more important than building your own game and building your own stuff because at the end of the day it's hard to work alone it's hard to work without uh being able to to grab pieces from others to improve your your own stack. So for me, my philosophy is, hey, if there's something that is out there, it's easy to use, and that can get the work done, let's use it, let's try, let's give it a try, let's give it a ride, and let's, let's see where it can get us. So this is what I'm trying to do with Lyra. I'm trying to see like how much I can learn from it, and maybe I don't, eventually I graduate out of it, and can continue on my own or if it does provides me with the tools to deploy my first game yeah I'm taking this course in Udemy it's really amazing uh, this guy this guy goes over so many great topics and it goes over the whole Lyra framework and um, it shows you how to customize it and most important that I've seen is it shows you how to understand it, navigate it, and um, so eventually you know where you, you can get your stuff. So uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, if you have any comments, let me know.